Hello, hello, internet. Uh, we're just waiting for the to live to uh, to the, for yeah. the live to go go live, but it's it's live. Uh, today we are presenting something funny, uh, something nice for for the community. Um, we are going to review uh, oh. this juice. I love cookies too. It's from Vape Mad Hatter. Uh, yeah, Sam, if you, you introduce the juice. Yeah. So I'll just post a quick link for you. Oh, let's see now. I'm gonna try some of it. I have it. I'm vaping yeah. it right now. Almost. Kiss my calls. All right. How are you guys out there? Everybody good? I can't see it. Let me, let me uh, see if I can get the uh, they're here. The separate link going. Get a separate screen going for you guys. Make sure I can see what's okay. going on. Now everybody's here. Everybody's live. Yeah. For anyone who's wondering, anyways, the name pretty much says it all. It is. Uh, it's a nice. It, it's a nice treat, you know. It's nice, little something different. It tastes like cookies. It's like a nice, nice doughy, very sweet. It tastes like cookies. Yeah, it's just like cookies. Yeah, it is cookies. Um, I can read what it says on the Mad Hatter website for you guys for now, yeah. and let's see if we can find it. With the outstanding popularity of our I Love Cookies flavor, we had no choice but to create the ultimate follow-up to our best-selling vape juice, I Love Cookies 2. Yeah. Uh, for anyone who didn't understand that, I Love Cookies 2 is not the first w version of this. This is actually the second version. Uh, infused with a caramel and strawberry flavor profiles, just like home-baked cookies, one will never be enough. And that is true. It is, uh, the, the, for me, the big difference that you get this little bit of, a little bit more than you got before is such a big difference. It's, it's sweeter, uh, tastes, uh, it tastes more sugary, more, yes. more glazing. Mm -hmm. As when you read it, I was like, oh yeah, caramel, that, that's yeah. it. It's very... That, the caramel note is really powerful. It's very delicious. This but, time around. But it's a cookie vape and it's really, really good. And uh, it comes in a gorilla bottle now. They For used, now. They used to come in um, glass bottles. Uh, I prefer these because it's easier to pour. Uh, easier to drip uh, or mm. if you have an RDTA uh, like the V-God then it's basically impossible with, with the glass dripper to yeah it's, it's I, but I have a hard, hard time with hard. the with the gorilla bottles as well because the, uh, the leak yeah e no not just specifically the leaking but this this uh, hello? anyone who can see this right here that juice build up right under the cap just pisses me it, it does it, it just bugs me but badly it, but it's the better alternative between between the two, I think. So, how are you guys doing? Every, is everybody okay? Is everybody all right? What are you vaping on? Uh, as a mixer, let me talk a little bit about this yes. juice. Yes. Um, if you vape the previous one, the one I uh, I love cookies, you will immediately recognize it yeah the profiles are similar it's an upgrade but as, uh, as sam said mm -hmm. they had strawberry in it yeah they even had a little bit of strawberry in it there's a significant more sweeter touch to it it's more sweeter and um, it tastes more caramel and mm -hmm. it tastes it has a fuller taste and it's 
a lot sweeter, a lot sweeter. It's like mm, candy. Mm -hmm. it's, it's very. It, it's more like home baked cookies, not the kind of cookies that you like go out and buy if you. And we're not going to name any brands or anything, but if you go out to your local supermarket, generic. yeah, it's not your generic type of cookies, no, you know, like not. chocolate chip cookies no. with caramel and strawberry infusion or something like that. Or if you just go out and buy regular cookies, um, no, what? what is, is that us? No, we're here. Okay. That's good. Okay. Um, it's nothing like that. It's more like the home bake style where it almost feels like you kind of got that creamy center going on you know when you just made a fresh batch of cookies in your oven and you just take them out and you get that nice crispy outside which goes like on the way in and on the way out you kind of on the exhale i kind of get that doughiness that would be you know yeah. from that home baked style cookies yeah but it's also important to uh, to talk about that because most cookies taste like cookie vapes mm -hmm. taste like cookie dough yeah. This one actually tastes cookie dough and cookie crust. So it tastes like a real cookie. Yeah. It's definitely, not, definitely. Uh, but um, I like it. It's it's my, uh, right up my alley. Yeah. I'm a bakery kind of guy. So this is what I would go for. If I went into a vape shop, it's this or a lemon cake or lemon tart. Or, or something if somebody would present this to me and say here you go can you vape this yes and I say well, I would say yes yes it's like giving Sam something with fruit punch and cooling yeah, I don't mind cooling but I do and you know you know as well as most people that have seen me you know that I enjoy the bakery as well yeah uh, and they kind of Matt Hatter has this awesome way of doing things uh, like for instance with their packaging and whatnot and I, I kind of it's like a little fresh thing it's, it, instead of using cartoons or um, some kind of existing other product, you know, like a lot of companies do f for their own commercialization, they, they, they just do their own little thing, you know? They got that, that I love cookies too on that side, and it's a heart-shaped cookie. Yeah. Uh, oh, heart-shaped cookie. <laughs> it, yeah, not a heart-shaped box with the Mad Hatter logo. You do have a... Uh, on this side, sorry, there we go. On that side, you got, got kind of like that kitchen cloth with that little yeah thing going on there. And on that side, you actually have a little mixer with some ladles and whisks and whatnot going on. And of course, one of the classic things that Mad Hatter does have is a uh, ser serving size, as if it would be like a regular Nutri type of as if it would be a pack of cookies you know nutrients yeah nutritional facts and stuff like that yeah and it's more like a fun thing you know just just for the hell of it and they state out that it doesn't have any calories it states if it has any nicotine how much nicotine it contains yeah the vgpg uh and it says real cookies zero grams zero percent sweet caramel drizzle 14 percent hint of creamy strawberry 11 percent Tastes like happiness, a hundred percent. It does. It does, and I, I I love that thing about Matt Hatter. They they, they do a little fun. Yeah, I think also I'm going out on a limb here, but I think there's a quote from uh, Alice in Wonderland, like C is for cookie and cookie is for me. Mm -hmm. When they having the tea session, you want a biscuit? No, and and the yeah yes, we're all mad here. The mm. cat, I think it's. Uh, uh, something like that but let's get to the point why are we ah. talking about these juices and, and why, why are we have addressed matchy matchy why do do we look like ollie g times two yes yes and why do we have the mad hat yes. logo because we run a facebook community yeah and we're based in sweden and we have recently uh, had a big discussion about different stuffs mm -hmm. that everybody in the group would know what we're talking about. So we have decided not to do any form of, form of uh, giveaways on... Uh, Inside the Facebook group on, at the moment. On e-juices. Uh, yeah. Uh, like, so we're going on YouTube to... Humpty and Dumpty. Yeah, Humpty yeah, and Dumpty. Humpty and Dumpty. Dumpty. Uh, 
the thing is, this is going to be a big giveaway. Yeah. A very big giveaway. But we want the people all over the world to participate too. Not only a couple of thousand Swedish people in our, our community. We are opening this up for anyone who's watching, anyone who's out there. If you appreciate Mad Hatter and the products that come out of that company, this is the place to be right now. So, if you, you want to win times two. Yes, times, times two. two. Times 100, two. 120 mils of this and some swag. Some swag from Manhattan. If you want to be the one of the lucky winners this week. To this week. To yes. Yes. That's very important for you guys out there. This week. Yeah. And, yeah. And we're not going to say anything more. But, yeah. but it's going to be more weeks. Yes. Yes. For so, if you want two bottles of I Love Cookies and some swag, you have to participate in the giveaway. Yes. And how do I do that? Check us out. Check my Instagram in a couple of minutes. Couple, yeah. After after the after live session the live, is done, yeah. A couple of minutes after that, there will be a post, and then Sam, Sam is going to post that too. And you can check our, our Instagrams out and get the rules. Uh, hey, John. Yeah, Mad Hatter reviews. Welcome, John. Welcome. Great to see you in and here tonight. You guys are going to see how you are. Uh, uh, how you're going to participate for yes. something like this. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, that's about it. Check out the Instagram. And uh, it's simple rules. It's not you, have, you don't no, have to do no. any stupid stuff. It's, it's pretty simple. Anybody can understand it. And uh, this week, it's two times I Love yes. Cookies too. You and get two 60 mil bottles and swag. Yes. Next time, uh, it's yeah. a surprise. But yeah. there will be next times in plural. Yeah, in, yeah. In plural. We're not done. This we're, is just the beginning not. of yes. our. Um, we're taking over the internet. Yes. And we're taking, uh, first the internet and then the whole world. We're giving everything away. Yes. Uh, and big thank you to Mad Hatter for for giving stuff. Yes. Away. Big shout out for that. We we're just uh, we we've we've been having a blast these yeah. and we've been having a hard time trying to keep this. Uh, we're, just, we're just brokering this deal. We're just yeah. We're this, just putting it out. You there. We're just putting it out there for you guys. And at the end of the day, as it's, we said so many times before, it's this from is, Mad Hatter. This to, is from to, Mad Hatter. To but you guys, right out to you guys. Every yeah. single one of you out there has the opportunity. And the option, we're not forcing anyone, but of course, the more the merrier, yeah, to if, participate. If you, if you don't want free stuff, you, yeah, exactly. you, if you, you don't want free you stuff, can go you don't buy have, it yeah. instead, no problem. <laughs> Nobody's twisting your arm to accept free stuff. Yeah. But it, if you would want to. Yeah, if you want to. I'm actually using the, the recoil with it, and I got the flavor bro cap on. Mm. Because this is my kind of vape. It's a bakery vape. It's very, very sweet. Uh, I love anything that tastes similar to this. And uh, so, of course, I'm going to like this one. Sam li likes it. I love it. I love like it, you it know? too. But, but I'm going for it in a copper neural Sub-Zero with the Sub-Zero RDA and a little chubby on top. Just to go all copper, copper, matchy, matchy. And as, as a comparison, we usually balance each other out pretty good. Uh, usually he likes the bakeries he has an all-day vape. Uh, I usually like the candies and fruits and whatnots and cooling and all that kind of stuff as an all-day vape. Uh, I enjoy bakeries as well a lot because I usually, if, if I'm going anywhere, I usually have two setups with me, for instance. And one of them will usually be something more towards the fruit, candy or whatever. And the other one will be a bakery. So either way, I will be going through at least both flavors throughout a day. Even if I'm not primarily just going for the bakery or not primarily just going for the fruits. I do that too. It's the yeah. thing not to get vapor stung. Yeah, that too. But I kind of get sick and tired of it. And I, for me, I don't like putting something bakery in an RDA. And then after a while, just dunking something else in there like a 
cooling kind of juice or whatnot and then you want to switch back it just doesn't it doesn't work I, I have to re-wick it for, for it to work out for me so and usually he has deregulated mods and he really enjoys those you do actually use mechs from time to time as well yeah uh, yeah pretty much but I pref nowadays I prefer like I go with the drag or I go with my uh, minikin uh, or, or my squonk yeah uh, I, I do tubes too uh, I have my broadside in the kitchen but like f for this kind of flavor when you on the run go out and you vape and you vape much then I prefer like the drag and the recoil uh, like this very easy yeah I, I like to complicate things so I, I usually if I'm going anywhere I usually have the car with me or someone's driving or something if I'm going for instance to a, a bar or something where I know I can vape or if it's a bar where I know the people I usually have a little kit with a bucket of spare batteries and that's kind of the way I like to do things and I usually do that and, and I usually bring the spare batteries for instance to do that and prefer the unregulated mechanical section of it all and keep going there usually from time to time sometimes I do use a regulated mod but it's not that common I enjoy my mech mods and it's it's kind of like a full-time hobby just to keep everything in play yeah, but you, you have to carry a lot of stuff yeah you I got yeah you, you have like 17 batteries yeah well, maybe a bit more right now all right all right anyone who's wondering This is no no the check you showed them the whole kit with the kit bag but it's like other stuff in it. Yeah, but no, don't worry. It's like this is uh, all right. Sam's all, uh, all right. Let, let's clear uh, some things out. The daily carry. Okay, a daily carry. All right, screw it. I'm going to show you guys a daily carry of mine. So if I carry this and two uh, but he he uses a subway battery. just to make things clear. I do not use a subway. If he uses that and maybe two or two or four batteries with me yeah in a box. Uh, I usually put this in the car this is a regular daily uh, go somewhere anywhere kind of thing where I got a couple of juices don't don't laugh at me all right and <laughs> I got a couple of juices I usually have some gum or something in there too I got my cotton upstairs uh, I got a little voltage checker I got some I got spare coil uh, scissors um, ceramic tweezers, regular tweezers, and then a uh, buttload of batteries. Yeah, I, I'm thinking like I could, I used to carry a lot of stuff, but now I'm like, so if, if I bake some shit, I'll just go to the closest vape shop. I, I don't, I don't like, do like, like to get and then yeah, I, 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 I get help from them. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 I. I <laughs> I enjoy having that uh, a bunch of stuff with me because I know if I'm gonna be somewhere out for a long time. Yeah. Um, if I'm, for instance, going through uh, a dual tube setup throughout the day, I know that I will probably go through maybe at least 10 batteries, at least. So. That's a lot of batteries. Yeah, but I mean, it's not that bad. In worst case scenario, I can just plug this into my power bank. Screw that. I have a charger basically wherever I go. I even have a I even have a power outlet in the car if I need to charge batteries on the go. But you know, uh, I kind of feel that I rather have more batteries than I need than run around and look for somewhere to charge or whatnot. So or, you're a battery hoarder. Yes, I'm yes. a hoarder. Yes. Oh, yes. My precious, my precious batteries. See there. Are, For, for you guys watching this afterwards, we have a lot of people in the chat as well. Um, uh, well why we're not like corresponding with them right now is because like this is a review and giveaway. Otherwise, on Sundays, on Sundays this is usually a whole different format. Um, we're just messing about, you know. Yeah, usually we we have discussions and it's more like a podcast, uh, like a, a talk show thing. But today it's all about Mad Hatter. It's, it's all about the Hatter. It's all about the Hatter. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, get your uses for free get your swag for free and uh, don't forget to give uh, mad hatters uh, mm. some some love and give us some love back for doing this it's a lot of hard work guys doing this for you uh, 
Yeah. People seem to forget that. Um, yeah, they, they, they think like... Uh, they think uh, we're just sitting and we waiting. We get everything for free. It's just oh, yes. raining shit yes. on us. Like, but uh, no, uh, no, no, it's not. No, no, it's not quite that simple. It's not that simple. We're not female rape models. No, no, no. Shit! If I could just sit there with a bikini, I swear yes. to God, people would start pouring shit over me. I love this. <laughs> yes. Yeah. <laughs> Hashtag feminism. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, I guess that's all for today. And now the Facebook community is gonna buy. But hey, how about us? Yeah. What, what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna cut this broadcast, and then we're gonna start another. Yes. In like five minutes. And the other one, the second one, is gonna be like as, like, as usual. As usual, we're same, same. gonna sit here and talk, yeah. talk shit on a Sunday night. But we're gonna have a five minute break, and I'm gonna post that post to Instagram. And mad love to Vape Mad Hatter for making this possible for mm -hmm. us. So, everybody in on Instagram in a couple of minutes, and then come back here in like 10 minutes. Go get, get a coffee, re wake, uh, whatever. See you in a bit. Peace.